Ladies and gentlemen, you know, lately things have not been looking so good for the immigrants that have been trying to come into the country. So immigrants can lose their green cards and face deportation if they make these mistakes. This came out in the Miami Herald, January 11th, 2020. It's a long and laborious road to permanent U.S. residents, one that opens a broad spectrum of job possibilities and offers reassurances to immigrants who can then live and work legally in the United States. But a green card, which leads to U.S. citizenship through naturalization, could be lost through mistakes, status abandonment, or deportation orders by immigration judges. The U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Service says these factors, whether intentional or accidental, could be construed as abandoning permanent resident status, making, uh, you know, moving to another country permanently. You know, yeah, that's a tough thing, but they've been doing it over here for years. They really have. U.S. laws also cancel permanent residence if an immigrant judge issues a final order of deportation because of serious crimes, including driving under the influence of alcohol or drugs. Ladies and gentlemen, here in my state, there was a big dispute with ICE because some of these places where they had sanctuary let a few of them get away and they had criminal records. So, I mean, it's a big problem and it really shouldn't be the big mess that we're looking at. All right, uh, USCIS regulation put in place last year requires immigrants to appear before an immigration court if they have abused any program related to public benefits. I don't want no Miami Herald, come on. All right, um, a person can be deported if there's evidence of fraud or willful misrepresentation in connection with any official uh, matter or application before a governmental agency the policy memorandum notes a uh, deportation order automatically cancels the green card. Immigrants face this scenario should seek legal help because it is very difficult to regain permanent residence status once the green card has been canceled. Well, Mm. The American Immigration Lawyers Association offers online list of expert professional license to practice law. Some immigrants also decide to voluntarily abandon their permanent resident status and surrender their green cards, according to USCIS. Well, they may do that, but at the end of the day, ladies and gentlemen, there are still some that once they step foot into this country, they can't even locate where these people are. You know, they have provided them with all kinds of sanctuary this and sanctuary that, and ICE can't touch them and the police can't touch them. And they have all kinds of status that we never had ladies and gentlemen in this country. We have never had these kind of protections, but they sure have the means to offer this to people that don't even live here. So immigrants are probably way more of a protective class in this country than a lot of Americans. I don't know too many Americans that get to hide out in a sanctuary state, city, or county, and you're untouchable. Nobody can touch you. The cops can't touch you. Ice can't touch you. No one can touch you. And you got politicians that will defend and protect this. 
and will even say, I've even seen um, articles where they say they will go to jail for this. Really? Really? And then, of course, we saw Nancy Pelosi and other politicians telling them how to avoid ICE. Don't open your door for them. Don't do this. Don't do that. They sure don't offer us any advice, do they? They don't want us to be a protective class. I think we should establish that at this point. They are not interested in protecting us. They want us to be fair game to anybody that wants to try to take us out. And the fact that the citizens will walk up to us and call the police on absolutely nothing is proof that they want us to always be sitting ducks in this country for anybody to do whatever they want. You know, just because they don't speak the words, that doesn't mean that's how they feel. So ladies and gentlemen, you know, it's unfortunate for these immigrants if they lose everything or they decide to leave on their own. But the bottom line is they got more perks up in here than we ever will. And that's a fact. And they have flaunted everybody before us in this country. And they have made sure somebody can come here from another land and have more status and more opportunity than us that were born here and been here our whole lives. That says a lot right there about this society. It says a lot. But y'all, please tell me what you think about this story. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell. And I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.